This is Becca Salamone, the voice of Alabama Horse Talk Radio, coming to you on location in Tuscumbia, Alabama, at the annual Alabama Championship Chuck Wagon Races. And I'm standing here with Chris Willis. He is with Aravac Life Team, and he's going to tell us a little bit about his business and how it's uh, going to help people that may get injured out here. Chris? Yeah, that's right. Uh, as a membership person for Aravac, we offer a, a service to the general public and for people who ride horses especially uh, in the event they ever have some kind of an accident and need to be flown in our aircraft. Awesome. So how does that work? Is it is it like an insurance or is it a membership? It's actually a membership. What happens is uh, people become members with us. They pay a small fee per year for their entire household and uh, because they support what we do in our local communities in return we offer free flights for any times that they, they receive those flights. Um, so technically it's not written up as insurance but it is a, a group of people that support us and the communities that we serve. Okay and where's this company based? Uh, we have our headquarters is in O'Fallon, Missouri and we have our membership headquarters is in West Plains, Missouri. So we are born and bred in the middle of America and we've gone from uh, one base in 1986 to 232 helicopter bases nationwide covering 28 states. Wow that's amazing. So you're a representative from this area is that right? Right. right. And, and do you just come to all these different events um, just to be on standby or do they have to request you to be there? Well the, what they've done here is they've actually requested Air Evac to bring the helicopter in during uh, the championship race and then throughout the day whenever we can we do have to always remember we have patient loads and and have to be ready for other other things going on in the community. Um, I do know we had a flight ar earlier this morning it, uh, that wasn't very pretty but um, as far as what I do I just basically serve the Shoals area and I'm the me voice of membership for uh, the counties we have locally. Okay and so for someone who's a member of um, AirVac what do they need to do if they have an accident? Do they carry a card or do they call in? What do they do? Well what we do is a lot of times what we're involved with is the 911 systems and the EMS people in the areas that we serve and for example we have a thing called automatic launch criteria in Colbert County and Lauderdale County, Alabama. And what that means is if anyone gets uh, a call comes in a 911 that fits a certain criteria, we automatically launch the helicopter to get to that location quickly so that we can be on standby if anyone does need to be flown. If uh, we're not needed, we just cancel and go back to our business and we don't charge anybody for that service at all. But for example, in Lauderdale and Colbert County, ejection from a vehicle, motorcycle, ATV, horse, bull, whatever someone could be ejected off of, 911 autom automatically launches our aircraft and sends us on the way uh, based on the fact that most horse accidents do result in neck and, and back trauma. So it's important to get those people quickly before swelling and shock set in and get them to a, a medical facility where that can be treated. Exactly. Now, uh, how would someone go about getting a membership, and how much the memberships uh, and are they uh, yearly or? We've got we've got yearly memberships. Uh, we got a three year, a five year, a ten year, and for some of you folks who are familiar with our evac, we used to have a lifetime membership, which is now uh, gone, but we have replaced it with a twenty five year membership. Um, prices as low as sixty five dollars up to eleven $1 hundred twenty five dollars for that twenty five year. So uh, instead of having to pay for it every year, you can have that option. But it's uh, basically $65 for an entire household, no matter how many people are in the house. It could be two or it could be 20. $65 covers that household. And if anybody gets flown, they don't owe us a bill. So based on your experience and, and you know, through the years of working for the company, um, how would you say that the value is for someone? You know, they it's pay price, the six It's priceless. It's priceless. I, your, our average bill right now across the United States is around $28,000 and insurance doesn't pay the entire bill. Um, it, it can vary between 40 and 80 percent is what we're seeing in pricing right now. So if, if the insurance company paid uh, 50 percent on a $28,000 bill, the average person is going to owe 16000 out of pocket. If they belong with their evac and it's us that flies them, they're not going to owe that out of pocket. We'll just take whatever insurance pays and consider it payment in full. Now, I, this sounds like a morbid question, but you know, if someone's out on the trail and they have an accident and they're knocked out uh, and there's other riders there, is there uh, like a little tag that you would, they would carry to let the people know that they have this? We have stickers that we put on people's uh, uh, vehicles. Uh, we have stickers that we could put on, we could put them on a saddle. I haven't ever seen one done that way, but, uh, and there are membership cards. But generally, um, if we run into it quite often, if someone's unconscious and 
if it's us or if it's a competitor or another company that picks you up, that's one of those situations where sometimes we just can't choose, and it may be somebody else picks you up, and of course you would owe them that bill, but you have to just think about it. Am I better dead or am I better, you know, maybe owing a little bit to someone else? So, you know, it happens quite often, but that's how we, that's how we, it's membership. We don't, ne we don't necessarily, well, we don't, we don't care if anyone's a member or not when we pick them up. We want to get them exactly where they got to go. Then we figure out who's a member and who's not uh, during patient billing and all that, things like that. So, you know. Well, that's great to know. Now, so where can people go to find more information on the company? You can go to Air. Uh, airmedcarenetwork.com and there's a click there's a link you can click that says membership and just follow the links on that to get you to the online registration and then you can reach out to folks like myself uh, you can call 800-793-0010 uh, and they can put you in touch with individuals in your area uh, who can who can do special things for you special discounts for different areas and things like that Okay, now you're out here at the Chuck Wagon Races. Are you going to be here for the rest of the weekend? Yes, yes. I, I've got, I'm going to be here all day today, all day tomorrow, and then Sunday. Awesome. Well, we appreciate you sharing with us, Ain't no Chris. Problem, no problem. And, folks, if you want to get more information on Aravac Life Team, you can go to alabamahorsetalk.com. In the meantime, start horsing around and just go ride.